Did you know guinea pigs, humans and certain primates are of the few animals that have a genetic mutation preventing their body from making vitamin C on their own. This means that they need to get all of their vitamin C requirements from their diet. You might ask, why is vitamin C important and what does it actually do in the body? Well, vitamin C is an essential nutrient that helps form collagen, which in turn is extremely important for healthy skin, tendons, bones, dentin, which is in your teeth, and blood vessels. Have you ever heard of pirates getting a condition called scurvy when out on the seas because they have not been able to consume enough fresh fruit and vegetables during their voyage? This is the same nutritional deficiency we are talking about in guinea pigs. In humans, it results in bleeding gums, bleeding under your skin and loosening of teeth. Have you ever wondered why pirates are known to have missing teeth? So what happens when guinea pigs don't get enough vitamin C in their diets? It can lead to poor dentin formation, which predisposes to dental disease. Teeth can become loose, rotated and overgrown, which can lead to a lifetime of other medical issues, including death. Poor collagen formation leads to a poor skin barrier. Wounds can take longer to heal and the coat can appear rough and disheveled. Affected animals also have a reduced immune system and are more susceptible to infections and illness. So what are some signs you might notice if your guinea pig is vitamin C deficient? They could be having trouble eating, have painful chewing, vocalizing when they are eating, grinding their teeth, and eventually not even eating at all. They can have a rough hair coat with dry hair that looks like it's lost its shine and poor or slow wound healing. Weight loss, diarrhea or stunted growth in young animals is also common. You can also notice an abnormal mentation in young animals who are vitamin C deficient. Lameness or swollen joints or not moving around as much. Constant or seeming like they are not able to kick off an infection or illness and eventually death. The most important part of treating vitamin C deficiency is to restore it back into the diet. The best way is to provide your guinea pigs with a good quality pellet fortified with vitamin C. It's important to note that vitamin C will degrade over time and even quicker if not stored correctly. It's also important to include lots of vitamin C rich fruits and vegetables into the diet. Here are some examples of some fruits and vegetables rich in vitamin C that your guinea pigs are sure to love. It's important to note that if your guinea pig is unwell, it will most likely require further supplementation of vitamin C. Please consult your veterinarian for further advice. The prognosis is generally good for most adults once the diet has been adjusted. However, abnormal tooth growth and dental disease may persist for life. Thank you for watching. We hope you learned something and don't forget to follow us on socials for more fun piggy content.